Hello, and welcome to the Williams Learning Lab. In this episode, we will be finding the average atomic mass of chlorine. To find the average atomic mass of an element, you're going to need to know what naturally occurring isotopes exist. We have chlorine 35, chlorine 37. Then you'll also need to know the mass of each of these isotopes and then the relative abundance of each of these isotopes. And so the relative abundance we're going to convert that into the decimal form of the percent. Just move the decimal place to the left two spots. Now, once we have that information, you can look that up on a chart. You are going to multiply the mass and the decimal form of the abundance for each isotope, and then you're going to add those numbers together. So it's going to look like this. So for the average atomic mass, to calculate that, we are going to multiply the mass of this chlorine 35, which is 34.9689, and then we're going to multiply that times its abundance. Decimal form, just move it over two places left, 0.75 seven, eight. Then we are going to add the product of the mass and decimal form of the abundance for chlorine. Uh, for chlorine 37, I should say. So then we have 36.9659 and then times our 0. 2422. Now, once you put that into a calculator, you will have a final value of 35.45. We're going to put this to four decimal places. Two, six atomic mass units. Well, it's as simple as that, guys. If you found value in this video, would you consider like, commenting, or subscribing? If there is a question that you would like to see answered, would you please ask in the comments below? Until next time, have a nice day. Bye.